as most of you already know, Esri customers have been using ArcGIS to create the maps that help run the world. Today, I'd like to show you how developers can create the apps that help run the world by using ArcGIS for developers, APIs, and SDKs. To begin, let's take a look at an app that I created for the Grand Canyon. This is currently running live in the browser and was created by using the ArcGIS API for JavaScript. The terrain and the imagery are brought in from the Living Atlas. And as we zoom in on the south rim, you're going to notice just how quickly it renders in 3D. Like most strips of the Grand Canyon, we're going to begin next to the Visitor Center at Mather Point. By using modules that are available inside of the API, we've created several tools that will allow us to help analyze the map. We can use this client-side line of sight to determine which peaks are visible and which ones are not. If we decide that we might want to take a hike up to the North Rim, we can use this client-side profile tool to analyze the change in elevation. Looks like from our current location, it's about a mile drop down to the canyon floor. And if you ask any ranger where the best place is to see the Colorado River, they will all say Lippin Point. By using a server-side tool to conduct a view shed, we can use the geoprocessing capabilities that are available inside of ArcGIS Online or a portal. Now if we zoom out, we can see that the best locations to see the river are to the north and to the west. By using ArcGIS for developers, let me show you how in just a few minutes you can make a similar app for your favorite park. Getting started with ArcGIS developers is quick and free. Just head over to developers.arcgis.com. From here, you can see the various platforms that we support. You can sign up for a free developer account. When you're ready to start writing some code, just click on Start Building Your App. The ArcGIS Dev Labs have dozens of easy tutorials that will help get you started with any product on a variety of topics. Let me show you how easy it is to create your very first app by using a JavaScript lab. To begin, we're going to open up a text editor and paste our main HTML. Then we're going to add the references to the ArcGIS CSS and the JavaScript API. And finally, we're going to add the script that loads the required modules, creates our map, and then sets the location by passing coordinates to the view. Now, when I save and open it in the browser, you can see our dynamic web map. For the next step, let's add some trailhead data and a search widget. We'll begin by adding a layer and a search module. Then we'll create the trailhead layer by connecting to a layer ID. We'll then add it to the map. Now we'll create the search widget and add it to the top right. Now when we refresh our map, we can interact with our trailheads and search for locations. So the code that we just wrote has 54 lines. I'd like to show you how by making just a few changes and adding a few more lines, we can create a full featured app with less, with less than 75 lines of code. Now, in order to speed things up a little bit, I'm going to enlist the help of a keyboard emulator to do most of the typing for me.
By using ArcGIS for develop developer tools, developers can leverage the full power of their organization's existing GIS infrastructure. In this example, we're going to be connecting to a scene view. When an analyst creates a layer or a map or a scene view inside of a portal or ArcGIS Online, it can be incorporated into an application with just a few lines of code. In the end, this saves the developer time, but it also allows the analyst to help curate the content. So now that our, our code has finished writing, let's take a look at the results. We now have a 3D application. We can interact with the layers. We can search for locations, turn layers on and off. We can see coordinates in multiple formats. And we can select other base maps. Now, I want to remind you, this was done in just a few minutes with less than 75 lines of code. And now that we have a great start, we can continue to add to this app by adding more lines of custom JavaScript to create your own custom tools. So if you're interested in making an app like this, or if you're interested in learning about using another package, such as Android, iOS, or Java, just head over to developers.arcgis.com and get started coding today. Thank you.